Greetings everyone, this is Danny from hardtravel.com, your Holland America cruise experts. And today I'm on board the beautiful Koenigsdam. Now this particular category is a balcony. So the standard balconies are all pretty much the same inside where you're gonna find the big differences between the VAs down to the VEs and VFs is essentially where they are on the ship. There's also the V category that's gonna have that secret bigger balcony as well. You, of course, you can see that right on hardtravel.com. Make sure when you're ready to book your next room or suite with Holland America, you do it on hardtravel.com. You can take advantage of the interactive deck plans to pick the perfect room or suite for you, your friends, family, or group at an incredible value and get the hard travel signature service every step of the way. Now let's tour the room. Now keep in mind, Holland America does a lot of longer cruises. Of course, they do short cruises as well. This particular ship does Hawaii round trip. It also does Alaska, Mexican Riviera, and you can piece them together to have a really long cruise. Now, anytime you do, you wanna work with a travel advisor that understands the differences with a longer cruise, and also all the Holland touches with quite a bit of storage, gonna go a long way on your voyage. Now, right here, you're gonna find the primary part of your storage. So you've got hanging storage up above. You're gonna have shelves up and down here. You've got your nice large golf umbrella, and then you're also gonna have a little bit of storage underneath as well. Now in here, you're gonna find your safe, big enough for a laptop and personal belongings. You're also gonna have those robes, you'll get those hung up in a minute, you got a little bit of storage there. Your mini fridge is just inside here, and then you've got more drawers for storage underneath, storage underneath here, and then a little bit more storage up above. Now let's head into the bathroom. Now to me, this is one of those spaces that's quite a bit of an improvement with this class of ship. Of course, right here, you've got your vanity, storage up and down, nice backlit mirror, little bit of storage underneath there. You've got your toilet tucked around the corner. This to me is one of the biggest improvements. I really like the size of the shower. I'm 6'6", six, six. I'm a big guy. I've got enough room to move around in here. You're gonna have your adjustable shower wand up and down, upgraded Elemis bath amenities. You've got your little footstool there. And then you're also gonna have your clothesline that'll pull across. So when you come back from the pool or the beach, you can hang your suit up. Now we're in the main part of the room. Keep in mind the balconies are the most prevalent category on this particular ship. It's a beautiful space. I really like what they've done with it. You've got a large bed here. You've got room underneath for storage. It can be separated apart into two as well if you prefer that setup. Those two uh, nightstands would go to the middle in that case. I like that the nightstands have drawers, lots of places to tuck things away completely. Now this is a new modern cruise ship. You're gonna have US plug and USB on either side. Really, really nice touch. You have your reading lamps and a lamp up above. You've got your hooks. It's that perfect place to hang up your jackets when you come in from a nice day in Alaska. And then directly across, you're gonna have a large flat panel TV. It's fully interactive, so you can see what's going on throughout the ship. There's other features as well, in addition to watching television. Now I'm gonna continue on through the space. Next up, you're gonna see you have a love seat right here. You've got a little bit of storage up above as well. These open up, you've got your life jackets and a bit of storage there. You got a small coffee table and then directly across, you're gonna find the small table that also doubles as a writing desk and a vanity. It's backlit here, more plugs, three US plugs, two Euro plugs and a USB. You can bring an extra Euro converter if you wanna use every single plug. Now keep in mind there are balconies that do have an adjoining interior door, perfect for families or friends traveling together. Right here is where the door would be in that particular case. So now we're out on your private veranda. So this is the standard veranda, that's categories VA through VH. And what you're gonna see is you've got two chairs and a table out here. Now for me, the reason you get a veranda is so you can come out, have a nice cup of coffee or tea in the morning, cocktail or glass of wine in the evening, but it's really all about that incredible ocean view, the fresh air and your private space. It's also another great place to take advantage of that 24 hour room service menu. So now we're in one of the category V staterooms that when you look on the deck plans, the rooms are facing forward to back rather than side to side. Now they're set up a little bit differently in here. You've got the bed, storage, bathroom over in the corner, and then you've got the, the desk right across. What's really different is tucked over in the corner here is your love seat, storage up above. And then outside there's a big space difference as well. So now we're out on your private veranda. You can see this is angled towards the back, this particular one. It is absolutely huge. So still the same furniture. You're gonna have the tables, the table with the chairs and ottomans. But what you get here is a ton more space. If you're traveling with family or a group, this is that perfect option. Now from here, you can also see multiple angles. So it's angled a little bit back. You get that full side view, but you also get more view towards the back of the ship as well. Now you'll also see Vs that aren't quite on the corner there that are facing front to back. This is the same one right next door here. So you have a bigger balcony out there as well. 
So now we're out on the balcony. You can see it's quite a bit bigger than a standard balcony. And this is one of the rooms, once again, that's a little bit, if you look in the diagrams on hardtravel.com, it's a little bit pointed, so it's facing just back. Larger inside and larger balcony. It may be worth that little bit of an upgrade. Now this is another one of those Category V balconies. This is one when you look on those diagrams on hardtravel.com. It's the standard interior size, but a ton more outside. So you've got a really, really large balcony out here. You're gonna see that you have two chairs and a table. So this is that perfect space where you can come out, have a nice cup of coffee in the morning or tea, or a glass of wine or cocktail in the evening. Now with any of the balcony spaces, you can take advantage of what I love so much about cruising. It's that beautiful ocean views, the fresh air, your own private space to enjoy. You can sit here with a book, relax, whatever it is that you'd like to do. But keep in mind, make sure that you go to hardtravel.com when you are ready to book your next rumor suite with Holland America. You can take advantage of those interactive deck plans and of course our videos so that you can put those together to pick the perfect rumor suite for you, your friends, family, or group at an incredible value and get that hard travel signature service every step of the way.